Hey all, this is Earth, and back by popular demand! I think I can actually say that now, <laughs> which is pretty cool. Uh, we have Thea, The Awakening, in another episode! Woo! So, we had a couple things from the comments we're gonna act upon right now. First of all, we had a name poll for the new Orc Warrior we had. Uh, I liked a bunch of them, I was gonna try to combine them. We only have 15 characters, though, so I went with Skull Cleaver. Because Thundax and Skull Cleaver, yeah, they're gonna be taking some heads. It's gonna be pretty. Alright, uh, also, we're gonna do a couple things in Ostoya. Mainly get our crafters crafting crappy things. Uh, so we can get some research out of it, which we're gonna do. So what we're gonna do first is dismantle some of the- Yes, doggy, I know. Dismantle some of the crappier weapons and armor we have. Uh, and our dog is obviously giving us a little bit of help. Uh, dismantle that. Yes. What does the bulk button do? Dismantle unequipped items. Yeah, let's not do that right off the bat yet. That seems to be a little more intense than I'm really in the mood for right now. Let's dismantle that. Dismantle that. Dismantle that. Is this thing any good? It's kind of creepy. Let's do that. And let's do that. I see some iron as well. And we're going to use some of these materials, uh, leather and dark wood. Sure, actually. Maybe get some good stuff out of that. Uh, to build uh, some bunch of junky kind of weapons. And that way, we can actually get research from that. And that'll be pretty cool. Uh, black sword. I'm seeing if there's anything I could possibly use here. Yeah, this will be worse no matter what. Just no matter that. And let's see if we can build something that's more than pies. We're never just crafting nothing but pies. We can go and build some stuff out of wood and then put it back together and get some research out of it. So much the better. So let's do, like, really simple stuff. Just wood. Uh, we something that's not going to be that potentially valuable. We have a crap ton of bones, I think, which we can use as well. I mean, wood would be the easiest. I guess that's why they suggest a shield for this, huh? Uh, let's go to light armor. Can we do that? Mm, no. Do one-handed swords this? Like, wood, wood, and wood? No, we can't. So no matter what, we're going to be using something useful. Let's go to heavy armor. We use bone, wood. It's probably the most research anyway we can get. Uh, not monster bone, normal bone. And let's go to uh, make some more wood. Yeah, there we go. So we give us zero research on that. Really? Oh, poo. Seriously? Okay, maybe they changed that or something since we patched it? I'm not entirely sure. They said shields. They, meaning y'all in the comments, said shields. Did this give me anything? That's gonna be eight research. I don't want to use the iron though. That'd be a damn shame, honestly. Interesting. So we need. So they can't really make crappy stuff for easy research anymore. It would seem. Um, can we do it like this? Maybe we have a lot of amber too. Wood, amber, and wood. Would that be alright? There's some research. There's three. So we'll make a bunch of training swords. We have a lot of amber. We have a lot of wood. We'll do that. Ad nauseum. We'll keep destroying them. Uh, for the sake of sanity. Who's our good crafter here? Shabovit's really good, uh, and Goshirada is our new one. Yeah, she's real good. Let's put her down here. I need to get this down to one day. That means we get Shabovit to do this, actually. Shabovit and get Goshirada back in here. Uh, yes. That goes to one day. Perfect. So we're going to do this ad nauseum until we run out of amber and our wood. We'll keep building them, destroying them, building them, destroying them, and we'll keep getting research every turn for that which is nice. It's about three by the looks of it. So we'll check that out next time. We're going to sit back here and hope we don't get attacked by anything nasty while we're digging up them dragon bones. So that's the plan. Let's see what happens. And we got an encounter because why not? Spider Queen and Malicious Spider. That we can actually begin the combat on. We have a lot of power here. Let's keep that in play. That works good for me. Uh, if I start making some bad players, it's been... <laughs> Full disclosure, it's been a little bit of a while since uh, since I played this, so um, maybe a little rusty. Anyway, uh, Tasha, get in there. Should be the first one to strike. Malicious Spider, Malicious Spider. Yeah, we can kill a lot of stuff easy. We can play two now. They can't do much damage, so let's keep bringing the heavy hitters out. Dropping that out. And we don't see the Spider Queen yet, so I don't particularly worry about the Confuse for now. We have a pretty high level Confuse. Do something nasty. Um, so 19 is pretty good on defense. Uh, yep, we'll just wait for a little bit until we see what we need. Spider Queen, there we go. Oh, she's already Confused, so she's going to be an easy kill. It's one kill, another kill, another kill. Not quite a kill. This will make the kill. And let's get, um, that'll definitely make the kill. Let's support the ally with some damage. Or we start dropping, no, 
we can pretty much kill everything here. So let's start dropping people in. Why not? Let's get closer. This will be pretty easy, I think. Mishlimir obviously is the, the big man on campus who's not in play right now. We'll get this rolling. Uh, let's put him here. We're just going to keep dropping bodies on here. We should be just fine. Just fine. Uh, and let's get you closer. Yeah, this is going to be straight up just slugfest and we'd totally fine with it. Totally cool. Alright, they're going to attack either Mishlimi or Grimadon. They're both going to be fine. You bastard. Why would you kill that one? Alright, we'll get the Spider Queen in here. It's cool. It's cool. We have armor and we have leech for a reason, so it'll be totally fine. Oh, as we keep destroying things, that was nice and easy. Nice encounter. I like easy encounters. They're much better that way. Yep, and we got three from the training sword and one from that. So we'll have three research pretty much every turn. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's begin combat, I guess. This got interesting. Okay, so these are not the best fighters we've got. Some of our good ones are down there. Wow. Yeah, this was unexpected. Um, <laughs> do we shuffle and... This is still pretty good, though. Let's keep and play that. If we can get an early one in quick. Yeah, let's get... Who's got not to get that much shielding up? Wait, check how I can get in there and do some work. We're just outnumbered here by a lot, and that's the problem. Our numbers are just not where they need to be. Uh, let's see. Because you can leech, and that'll be some good damage initially. You're a pretty big swing. There are only hammers down here, which is a shame. But I can't really afford to just drop him in there without doing good work. Get the beam out in there first, and then we'll take Kajik in the back with a 14 armor. That'll be all right. We'll only play one for now. So that's, oh, that's a lot of damage. Good God! Okay, I didn't expect that much damage out of this stuff. And they got to play two. Oh, we're going to get creamed here. Wow, and we only get to play one card again. That's a really bad first roll. That might be the end of it. Ah, oh, shoot. That's really bad. That's really bad. We could use this, but Zora might just go down. Why are we only get to play one card, but they get to play like three? That's really frustrating. Can't confuse anything save the craftsman. I mean, I have to get people down right now, but I'm gonna get whooped here badly. Ugh, okay, I'm not happy about this. I need to play two more again. Look at this crap. Oh god, this is bad. I'm only playing one a turn. It's really frustrating. So they just have more people. We're going to take massive casualties here. Oh, God. I think we just need to drop people in the fight right now. I can first action Wojciecha to do a little more work. That's probably smart. We're going to have just out tacticum somehow. I'm not sure how we're going to do that, though. First action her. We'll be able to kill the boar rider, and that'll be a lot of damage less. The 38 is going to... Oh, it's going to absolutely destroy stuff. Oh, God. We first action anyone else. Hmm. We try and counter tactic. We can't really confuse much. We try and shield. Shield Zora, but. Let's see. That's going to be a kill here. So no worry about that. The 38 is going to come probably to. The Biemar, and he's going to get killed because of it. Because 38 is way too much damage. I think I need to put her first. I just do a little more damage to all of this because because then we could hit seven plus seventeen will be thirty-four. It's enough to kill that one. I get a good swing on the skirmisher, and there was a chance to get him down actually. Okay, let's first action her. I'm not sure how I'm gonna play this now though. This is gonna get another boar rider. Oh Jesus! All right. Um. At this point, we're down to just keeping people alive, more or less. Let's 
shield Kaji because he's gonna take a whooping and he's gonna have to tank up some. Oh god, and what are you gonna do? You're gonna first action the warrior. Oh, shoot. The best we can do is that. Oh, she's gonna get killed, isn't she? We can get closer here, but that's gonna leave us prey to the boar rider, which doesn't make sense. Try to confuse, but this is not gonna go well. We're gonna get hit really hard here, and I'm not a fan. Uh, screwed up the priority too. We're not gonna get a kill on the boar rider that we wanted to. That's already dead. Look at that. Oh god, that was terrible. That first action, that last first action move really screwed us. And now we're gonna lose people hand over fist. Because that freaking skirmisher. Look at that. You can just knock these people down in one go. And he's dead now. Oh, that's like three dead people. Oh my god. You know, just when I said, <laughs> time for a new series, this may be pretty much over before it started. Uh, despite our defensive military, we just got crushed hard. Ah, oh, that's really bad. I mean, the only thing I could pretty much do here is get people in play, but, I mean, this is over, effectively. I don't think I can do anything. I'll, I mean, I'll get as many in play as I can, but this is not gonna happen. Can we first action anybody of use? No, she's pretty much screwed. Yeah, I think this may be the end of Ostoyas. <laughs> oh, God. Well, there's a lesson. Uh, don't, I mean, I didn't expect this much of a, a rough go of it. Skirmisher is absolutely bone crushing, and he got to go first. Well, that's not going to go well. Still the warrior, at least. So, he's somehow still alive, because he's chunky, I guess. But the skirmisher is going to get the war, and then. That's our heavy artillery down, effectively. And I want you to not attack that guy. How about the ones that are close to you? That's how they're supposed to work, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. This is pretty much over. Everybody's more or less dead here. Um. Wow. Okay. I guess that's how the game rolls sometimes. I really don't have much to play here. I could just surrender it, but I want to see how many of these guys I can kill. Yeah, this is over. This is effectively over. Let's see. Yeah, I mean, this is just too much. That guy got too many swings. That that one first action move that they played, that absolutely screwed me. And then I have nothing left. Okay, they, he can one-shot people, and that's just game over. Yeah, no kidding, dude. Yeah, this is not good. They're all probably going to die. There's another, another four-square army. All right, this is going to be... This is going to be very... We have no one's died, which is a small miracle here. Seriously? No one's died? Okay. Well, they, may, they will die next turn, probably. Oh, God. So so much for gathering those dragon bones. I mean... Wow. Yeah, that's not so good. We'll keep you doing what you're doing, I suppose. But it's not going to get us much. Ugh. Alright, we have this down here. We're going to see a lot of gravestones. Don't blame that is dead. And, yeah, this is going to be it. Let's try again. I need to reshuffle this because my fighters are back there. Don't lose the 20. Don't lose the 20. Okay, we still have the 20. And they get to go first again. And they're going to be able to outplay us, I think, again. Well, Zora is going to have to really bite it down. She goes first. Maybe have a chance to kill the boar rider on the first go. He won't be able to deal us 32 ridiculous amounts of damage. Uh, and we can play another card, and so we can go here and swing. Uh, this is not good right now. Shoot, and he got armored. We support an ally somehow. We can first action so be and that'll be the most important thing we can do, I think. First action, you get in. I'm not sure what else I can do here. That skirmisher is still there, which is what freaks me out the most. I can't counter tactics. I can't really confuse much. I can try and shield, but I think getting a fighter on the ground will be more important. A fighter. Go shit out our fighter. Yeah, uh-huh. Um, and let's go shield go shirada. I think it's the best thing I can do. And I can't confuse, I can't counter tactics, so let's just shield up. Oh no, I can't play this yet. You're gonna first no, you can't first action, no more tactics available. Alright, so let's shield up, go shield out of that so she has less chance of dying horribly. 
All right, this may work. I'm not sure though. I think we'll be okay on this one. Okay, the skirmisher's dead. That's the most important thing. That's what that shield is for, and I think we've got this now. Okay, second go, but we have another four skull army heading our way, and that's not very funny right now. Ugh. What is this? Goblin boss, goblin shaman, and six others. Okay, well, y'all y'all got better, I guess. Um, but it's not going to get us very far, I'm afraid. How are we doing on our research tally here? Uh, go to Stoya, which we're rapidly running out of people with. Let's see. Production. We're making a pie a day, still we're making a training sword. Unfortunately, one of our best crafters bit it, so that's not good. Don't care about that so much. That's a problem. Uh, I gotta get Grimnon Co. back. I gotta bring more people back. Ah, uh, I've just got to the Dragon Bones, too. One turn for five Dragon Bones. It's gonna be just one Claw of Velash. It's not gonna be enough. But I have to go back to defend the settlement after this, because we're getting pushed on. And if we keep seeing stuff like this, I'm not gonna be able to fight these. Um without that many people, so I don't really... I may have to just go for broke. Take all 16 people and just go at the goblin army because we're not going to survive. We're going to go one more go here. Um, that one mercilessly, mercifully left us alone. And as much as I don't want to do this, I think I need to break camp. And I need to head back. Uh, so break camp and go back home. Uh, I need you to do that right now. What's the fastest way here? Hold on. Let's not move yet. What's the fastest way to Ostoya? Probably is that way, actually. Uh, you can go 19. That's the fastest way you can do it. All right. Um, let's go away from the goblin army a little bit. I don't want to get hit by that one first. All right, so it's going to be happy this way. Okay, we're by a spider's nest. That's all right. I don't particularly care about that. I got to find a way back. And that's the biggest issue. All right. Get yourself... Yeah, keep moving. I guess that is the fastest way to do it. Keep moving this way. <sighs> Boy, I don't know. It's kind of like a rush against time here. And we got to leave some orcs back here in Astoria, apparently. Because these guys are not defending themselves enough. How many kids coming up? No, we don't really have much choice. We're going to have to bulk dismantle all these. Yeah. How are we going to get leather if we used amber? No, I guess it's random. That's interesting. It's actually not cued to what you make it with, I guess. First one was leather. Maybe that was the old training sword. Who knows? Either way. Uh, keep researching, guys. Because apparently our days are numbered here. Alright, this is going to be relatively easy to calculate through. Just auto-resolve that. That really doesn't matter. That may matter a little more. What is this now? Unliving corpse, spine queen. Oh, this is getting better and better. Alright. Proper combat this time. Uh, with a team ready to combat some evil. Let's reshuffle real quick so some big swingers are not in the main go. Yeah, that's a little better. They get to go first, of course, because God knows I needed that on my conscience. Who's got the... Mishlimir's down here because the leech guy is not here. We can confuse the Spider Queen, which will be worthwhile. Confuse the Spider Queen. Get Tasha out. She does 40 damage, has 30 hit points, and 7 shielding. So that's okay, I guess. They get to play 2 now, which is a problem. But that's not going to do too much damage to her. The other Spider Queen is, however, a problem. That is a huge freaking problem. All right. We need to be able to kill that thing quick. And we need someone to tank it up. So Skull Cleva is going to be all right at that. So is Thundax. Let's get Skull Cleva out and cleave some skulls, comma, yo. And he's going to need to, or Tasha may need to absorb that damage. I'm not sure where that swing is going to go down. So why don't we just start dropping people in here? Could counter some tactics, some offenses, but it's not going to have enough... Let's shield up. Now we need to keep parity with what we have on the board, though. Because with more units, you need to have you need to have your stuff swinging too. They have they have numbers, which is the problem. They're not strong, but they have numbers. And after a while, they're going to start telling on us. Uh, not like he did this, but you know, like the numbers will start telling. Um, okay, so Thundax is probably going to be taking a bit on the chin here. Probably want to shield up Thundax. He's going to be in the thick of it. He's got like five things around him. As much as I want Elishka in the game, I'm not going to have her have that ability. The crow's down there. All these things are able to do so much damage, and we're not able to do much about it. Get Elishka down. 
What we're probably gonna do is try to counter the last tactic. Got it. Got the troll A-bomb out of it. And then we'll be able to shield our last Eliska here. For the very least here. And then we'll be okay. I mean, this is gonna be a tough fight also. I'm not looking forward. Dead Spider Queen. Okay, that makes things easier. He attacked left. She attacked forward. Shoot. But she's dead now. He's dead. That's what the armor is for, but this is gonna start going down much quicker. Thumbnex is cracking. Okay, we're doing damage. We're doing damage. Tasha took a little bit more than I would like. I think we're doing most of the work now here. Ah, uh, he's gonna get a swing at her, but we have armor. Okay, that was okay. That was actually quite okay. Uh, that'll work for me. Let's keep and play these. He has to go first. I'm gonna put Mishlimir out there first then. Uh, so you can absorb the damage and then also do the life suck. And then let's go with Ludmila right there. And that was a good round for us. It looks like we can handle three skulls pretty easy. Four skulls and above, uh, things get nasty. Let's get Skull Cleaver out. And let's get Moimira out. And I think we can handle this more or less just by sheer weight of numbers. Unliving Corpse is not gonna, he's gonna be even less living shortly. The rest of this, I think we can just clean this up. That's going to be a kill there, kill there, kill there. Yeah, it's, let me just end it right now. Apparently, the entire house is falling at this point as well, which is fascinating. It's a new new feature of this game. Uh, causes your house to fall. All right, good. Eight down, but she's not in danger. And we got another encounter because God knows we needed that in our conscience. Auto resolve that. Fine. It was a spider queen, but we're okay. Oh, wow, that's a lot of spiders. Okay. Whew. Oh, we have new research available. Okay, so we have dragon bones. That was nice. We can craft. I'm starting to think the uh, the watchtower wouldn't be bad <laughs> to have at this rate. Um, but let's see, what is this? Smithy's better crafting. We're doing okay on crafting, actually. Well is random stuff. What better gear can we get? I guess we can get shields. We have one-handers already. We get more food, I suppose. Staves, and that'll probably lead to spears. Clubs, and lead to war hammers. Might go that way. Uh, but, I mean, we have the dragon bone. That's really what we want as far as equipment goes. We can go for... We already know the mithrils. We're not getting that anytime soon. We have to find a way to knock those big camps down. That's my biggest issue right now, I think. Um, so yeah, resources I'm not too worried about. The most important thing I think be better weapons, because we're just getting pushed on so hard. Oh, we're gonna do artifacts, weren't we? This could be pretty cool, actually. Let's try artifacts. So this is kind of our exploration game, anyway. And this is giving us research from whooping all these, anyway. So let's just hunt. We don't have a lot of hunters here. Got it, but we won enough, apparently. Keep trying to head up to, uh, back home. That's a lot of stuff, man. I think we do have to make just a massive, massive push to get rid of some of these things. Uh, get hunting, auto resolve it, fine, okay, done. We do need to make a massive push to resolve some of these goblin armies that are surrounding us, because this is just going to get worse and worse. And I'm not sure if we're going to be able to survive the next wave, because we're already losing a person. We're losing more people than we can actually produce. What is this? We get the priority on this? Not sure who this is. Can we do social? We can try social. Baba Yaga. Okay, so this is a good choice. The Baba Yaga is going to be scary with the social, but these three are not. Rats don't talk so good. Uh, except for ours. Ours talks okay. Baba Yaga's going to go first, obviously. Yeah, she's going to be the toughest one. That old witch. Um, okay, Moimira. She will survive the Baba Yaga's verbal onslaught initially. We need another big talker. So we get Tasha out there. She's a good talker as well. But yeah, the rest of these are not going to do anything, I don't think, which is exactly the point. Uh, let's get... Well, let's get everyone who can actually swing a word or two. Yeah, the orcs are pretty good talkers, I gotta say. Skull Cleaver and Thunder X gonna break you! And then everyone's like, Oh my god, they're gonna kill us all! And then you're like, Yep, you're absolutely right, they're gonna kill you all. The way it works, man, the way it works. Go. Alright. Deformed Bat cannot say anything, apparently. Uh, what can we play? Let's just get closer on everyone. Yeah, our rat talk real good. He got 2-3 and leech in that. Our, our rat is a scary rat. I guess there's letting me go in 
whole hog. This is our smartest talker. At least she got with her broom. With her come hither broom is our best talker by far. Uh, get closer on Ludmilla, and then... Oh, I can't do this yet. Oh, just end your turn, you git. Alright, go on. Get, get, go. get closer, get closer. Vishlimir, get closer. Yes. Vishlimir with the hammer. Alright, opponent's turn. Are you going to be done? You're not going to bother playing, which makes sense. Oh, don't worry about it. Oh, oh Baba Yaga, oh, talk real good. Oh, don't worry about it. You're dead. Oh, don't worry about You're dead. Oh, don't worry about it. It's like letting me kill the Baba Yaga oh, at this rate. Um, and then she's going to get Mimira out of the equation. Oh, but we're going to get the Baba Yaga down. Oh, don't worry about it. There we go. That's the most important thing. Oh, don't worry about it. After that, it's pretty oh, much game about. over for them. All right, that oh, worked out pretty well. I'm glad we had the social ability to run that through. Uh, they fled. Got some fruit, got some chicken, and got some elven wood. Very nice. All right, let's keep going back to Stoya. And like I said, I think uh, a last stand against the mighty hordes against us. Hunting. Let's go hunting. Begin combat. Don't have a lot of good hunters, but that's the best we're going to get. I have this feeling this was a bad idea. Uh, maybe okay. But without our hunter, we, this is not a good plan. Uh, I have this. I have a sinking feeling. We can get most of our fighters out there, but everywhere else, we're going to have to do the best we can with confusion and countering offenses and stuff. So let's counter the biggest offense they have. Thank you. We counter a tactic. Can we counter tactic for enough? No, we can't. Let's confuse that guy. The orcs are really good at confusing. Orcs are pretty tactical guys, I gotta say. They're doing really good. Oh, Grimnaw has three poison. I forgot that he can actually fight this. I never looked down here. I really should. Can't confuse anything. Can't counterattack. Let's support an ally. Do some more damage. That's what the bows are for, honestly. We'll be able to do some good damage. You guys can't do anything save absorb damage. Let's just go. Clamp that. Clamped you. And we didn't kill anything. Oh, we did. Because Grimnaw's badass. Alright, Ludmilla's getting that one. Why we didn't hit left, I'm not sure, but okay. Nice. Good. Excellent. Uh, we got some meat and bones and furred leather. 3 XP. We can get home now. Please let us get home. We're bringing five dragon bones. Precious, precious indeed. Uh, but it looks like we're going to have to do the best we can with this right now. Okay. Ostoya, get on this. Uh, give you that. 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 Alright. That's about as good as we're going to get. We have a bunch of crappy things here we can dismantle. Let's just get rid of that, I suppose. We'll, we'll do this later. Alright, the Svarog shield, monster shell, that we can... The jerkin we can get rid of. Oh, we have a scaled armor here. That'd be pretty good. Alright, and we have a scary iron mask as well. Um, okay, this we can go back on. This we can go back on. That we can go back on. Just getting rid of stuff we don't need. And I'm probably just going to go all out here, honestly. I'm so sad that we lost one of our best crafters shit. It would have been really kind of handy these days. But most importantly, we can now produce a awesome, awesome dragon bone two-hander. It's just, you know, we won't have much to do with it, unfortunately. Okay, so our best gem, if I'm not mistaken, was, the, was it the ruby? I think it was the ruby. And we have coal to fire it up. 13... And 11 leech. That's pretty freaking cool. Is that as good as the weapon that we have on uh, Mishlimir is? Mishlimir? No, 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 not Kajik. Uh, wrong person. There we go. Mishlimir, you have 19 and 10 leech. What did you make? Oh, we made him with Mithril. Of course, we made him with Mithril. That's right. <sighs> okay, production. Ostoya, yeah, sorry. Let's go back to this. So, Dragon Bone, yes. I wish I had a little more. Uh, two, two more bones would have been so perfect. But we don't have it, so there. We can't make it with Mithril. We can't make it with Steel. We can make it with Silver. Let's see if that's any better. We had 13 with the Ruby. Can we make it with Silver? 15. Okay, Silver is better. Okay, so we'll be able to use Silver at the very least on that. I think Gold is... I think Gold is worse. Yeah, Silver is better. Which <laughs> makes sense, I guess. Better against Monsters, I suppose. In the Lexicon, 11 leech. So 15 and 10. This total of 25 versus... Wait, did we get more leech with the ruby? I think we did. 13, 11. So, less overall damage. And less shielding here. We do more damage. I'd prefer more shielding and leech, actually. So, let me get the ruby in there. That's probably better off. 
Yeah, make another claw, Velesh. Uh, we're gonna need this with a quickness. We have no more crafters that can really do this well. I take it off the training sword for a second. We need four days to pull that off. Can we do that with three? We do it with three. Okay, that's fine. We're doing all right on pies. Okay, so wow, no real good solutions here. You could try for the divine quest, but I feel like we have enough problems just home here. This is just ridiculous. We need to deal with. If we go all 15 with some decent arms and armor, we may be able to take it up. We could try social, but I don't know if we'll be able to talk down what we need there. We'll give it a go. That seems to be the best solution we've had in a couple of what happened here. Yeah, we production tasks are stopped, but that's all right. What poor production task we have is making that new Kalal Velesh, and we are still two days off of that. Two days off of that. All right. We're going to wait for two days. Okay, made it. Made the Kalal Velesh. No one's doing something. All right, buddy. You keep doing that. And the question is going to be now. I have to search my soul, my mind, as to whether we try and go after them goblin camps. Because uh, social might not do it for us. We may have to go full on in the front. At least we have another Claw of Velesh to do so with. Uh, with that, though, with that thought and the concern of going full on against these goblins, uh, I'm going to have to call it there, guys. Thank you so much for tuning into this continued adventures of Thea. We're not dead yet, which is all we could say, honestly, with this roguelike-ish -like game. Uh, we are not yet dead, and that's all good as far as I'm concerned. I have a nurse. I'll see you all next time we continue the journey. Till then.